Louis Carapi here for CS MMA with Kyle Bokniak. Now, Kyle, that was an awesome fight. Three-round, action-packed war. Give me, give me some thoughts on the fight, your take on it. Well, I knew uh, Russo was going to be a game opponent, so I really wanted to make a statement for the featherweight division out there that, you know, I'm a game opponent and I'm, I'm a fighter to take serious, you know? I, I'm an up-and-coming fighter and I trained real hard for this fight and I, I didn't want to get sucked into his, his game because I know he's a brawler. And when he gets rocked, he just gets super aggressive. The hands go, you know what I mean? We just start swinging for the fences. Yep, and that to, definitely happened. It happened, you know, <laughs> I said it wasn't gonna happen. I was gonna stay calm, stay sharp, and try to land some crisp one-twos, take him down. But, you know, we made an exciting fight, and I just, I, I wanted to prove to myself, especially, that I had the heart. I knew he was gonna test my heart, and, you know, it, it, it was tested. And I came on the top, <laughs> and I, I I can't be any happier than my performance, and I'm sure my fans and family are proud of me, and you know what I mean? It's just, yeah, no, I mean, it was an awesome fight, awesome war, three rounds of action, which is tough yeah. to do, but you showed you're you know, a big, strong 45er, but you also have the cardio, which is, yeah, which I mean, you know, it's tough for that. So is that something you trained for in this oh, fight, yeah, expecting exactly, that? Exactly, yeah. I've always had good cardio. I you can ask my coaches and trainers, I, I've been gifted with a gas tank, but I knew that I had to spike it for this fight. You know, I did a lot of road work. I, I cut back on the strength training. I did tons of road work, tons of interval training, sprints, running six miles four times a week. I wanted to make sure that I spiked my cardio perfect for this fight and I, I did it right. Awesome. And I think that's what it was. We're, we're going through those grueling, grueling states and all I can remember is that road work that I did. I did not <laughs> quit. You can't quit when you're running, you know what I mean? So You cannot. It, it helped a lot. So yes, I trained specifically for Rousseau awesome. for this fight. I wanted my gas tank to be there and it was there. Great. Now, this is probably your breakout fight at 145. This is going to get you noticed. Yes. You know, it was an awesome fight. It puts you up there. What do you think is next for you? What's is next is, uh, you know, I was talking to Pat and trying to get on um, the, the, the the Access TV when they're going to be doing the live. They're going to only have six fights and gonna, you know, we're going to be on those shows, that's those awesome. fights. So that's the next step. You know, I, I look at every fight as a stepping stone. So I wasn't looking beyond this. I knew I had to prove myself tonight that I'm a game opponent and I'm a serious opponent. So people want to market me and help me get to that next level. So, you know, I'm humble. I take it one fight at a time. And now we're looking to live television yeah. and take it from there. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, What's you it? definitely showed all those attributes that you mentioned, Kyle, so yeah. it was a pleasure watching you. Thank you so much. Thank you, sir.